we don't about the writing news, writing magazine, recording. We learn again about uh, how to make documentaries, how to take a lovely pictures, and how to make some fiction films. So all those knowledge came from backpack journalism because we're learning about backpack journalism. I mean that you can be able to do everything yourself as a backpack journalist. Other people, they say that that, that that is nothing, but for me, it means many things. Because they know that again, help me strictly now, first from Zaleka, because I didn't just stay down, but continue to work in my community for more than now three years. I use it to help my own community. And whatever that I went one day outside Zaleka, let me say, let me say abroad, the same knowledge, knowledge that, that I have here, I, I will use it wherever I go in this world. In my career, that I chose since I was young, is to be a professional journalist. And that's why I don't gain many things or millions, but I'm happy because I still continue doing what my heart wants. That I'm still following my way, following my career, and that is my happiness. He asked us to just write two articles each and every month. And then he told us that we should make a documentary, one documentary in six months, and one film fiction a year. For the film fiction, we are preparing what a, a film that will be called A Teen Mother. It's, it's a wonderful story about the teenage mother. In the refugee camp. That idea came out that, that, that we can build something interesting that the world can learn from it. As I, as I said before, that the dream to be a journalist doesn't come just like this. It's in my, it, it, I mean, it's, it's, it's like a, it's, it's in my blood. Means that these are just the beginning. I believe that, that once I get an opportunity to go abroad, I will do my best to continue to, to become what an international communicator in the world. And I believe one day we're going to meet again and do things in the, in the highest way in the world. I believe that. <laughs>